In this lecture we will talk about Mongo shell and Mongo server. When you install MongoDB, you'll get those two applications. MongoD command is used to launch Mongo server and Mongo command is used to launch Mongo shell. Those two applications are separate. But what those two applications do? Mongo server stores data in the MongoDB database. It is the main point of data storage. And Mongo shell is used for management of the Mongo server. Using Mongo shell, you can insert documents into the Mongo server, you can update documents, you can delete documents and so on. In other words, you can perform all kinds of CRUD operations, create, read, update and delete. And that is a Mongo shell. Both Mongo shell and Mongo server are based on the JavaScript engine. In order to manage MongoDB server, you can use Mongo shell located on the same computer. But you can also manage remote Mongo server using local Mongo shell. For example, you can connect to remote MongoDB server using MongoDB shell installed on your local computer. And please remember those two commands. MongoD command starts MongoDB server and Mongo command starts Mongo shell. And again, those two applications are separate. Ok, let's move on to the next section, where we will discuss MongoDB installation. And you will install MongoDB on your local computer. We will also cover MongoDB Atlas, that is a cloud solution that offers MongoDB as a service. Ok, let's move on. See you in a bit. Bye.